like, ah, oh, you missed exactly that by like five seconds. You just missed it. Alex says it's coffee. Alex says it's coffee. But do you know where that's from? No. I got two pickles. I got two pickles. I got two pickles. Hey, 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 hey. Now that just made it harder to tell. <laughs> Alex, why do you have two copies? My dad dropped one out. That's so nice Live. of your dad. <laughs> You're live. It's, it's competing brands. Good morning. Happy Friday. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. Rudy, come say hi. What's up? What's up, kids? How's everybody doing? Um, I'm a little of stuff. Are we doing this again? No. <laughs> just do one one live for you guys to see what we did yesterday. Oh, we should we should have done that live. We could do one live. You guys want to see one live at the end of the stream for fun? Morning, yeah. Friday. Oh wait, I can hear Roxy. Yeti, what's up? What's up, Yeti? What up, Drac? What's up? What's up, kid? All right. <clears throat> The Friday's uh, kicking off. I, Friday's kicking off with me being super lazy. Um, I woke up late. I came to work late. And I scrambled to make a... Scrambled. Scrambled eggs. What's up, son? <laughs> uh, son. What's up, son? I mean, Han. <laughs> what up, son? <laughs> what up, son? <laughs> he mixed your last lit. Oh, man. I don't know. Oh man. Okay. Uh, today's workout, you're gonna burn all your body fat, all of it, and then you'll die because you won't have any body fat. So that's it. That's what we're doing today. I'm, I've come to the conclusion that um, good content, like actual meaningful content, doesn't get people to click. So we're just gonna say outrageous shit. <laughs> Nobody cares about good Nobody information. Nobody cares. So we're just going to say outrageous shit and get people to click. Clickbait galore. Um, Out. We're going to start right here. All right, we're, oh, we're almost that's... perfect on time. Okay, great. What is this display you are presenting? So Roxy and I played a spelling bee yesterday. Uh, you guys will see a video. Who uh, won? Uh, I don't know if anybody won. What? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if anybody, I think you guys won, to be honest, when you see the video. Um, Roxy did get like a hand from God that saved her yes. multiple times. And I did not. <laughs> I did not. I did not. Uh, and I have some bruises to prove it. Oh my gosh, let's see them. Here's one. Here's another. And then there are some on my face. I did that. <laughs> there are some on my face <laughs> that you can't see. San Holo, what's up? Um, let's, let's Thank see. you. My, you read my I, mind. My iPad's probably dead too. And, okay, let's put that over here. Do you want to use my phone? No, no, because we need to go on stupid epidemic sound. It'll just take a minute. They can just hear our beautiful voices. <laughs> We're both wearing white. Um, this is great. What did you do in my coffee? There, over here. Oh. Like way too close. I just need one of them. Which one this do you one, want? This one's colder. I want the colder one. Um, I do like to drink my coffee slightly cold, like a weirdo, so don't at me, bro. Um, today we're get, we're, today's workout is going to be some compound uh, weightlifting. I know uh, Misfit wants to lift. Uh, it's going to be fairly leg heavy because we didn't do much legs. How do your legs feel from the last workout? Sore. Sore on the inside? Yeah. Oh, okay, good. Uh, my legs are also yeah. sore. Um, I'm excited to run um, today, later, at some point. But yeah, so we're going to do a giveaway today based on the video that we made yesterday. Uh, there's some giveaways. We're going to start the giveaway today. You have multiple things to choose from. Um, I'm going to relate some of them back to the challenges in Fitcoin. Oh, as always, this stream is brought to you by Fitcoin, the only application, fitness application, that rewards you, truly rewards you for your exercise and calories burned. Thank you, Fitcoin. We appreciate your sponsorship. They don't pay me. Um, assholes. <laughs> So we're going to do some compound work. We're going to give away some fitness stuff. And some of it will be given away in the challenges in the app. Some of it will be given away here. Um, we're going to start our Friday off with a giveaway and we're going to do it here. So today's workout, and there's really no challenge. It's going to be just completely arbitrary. Everybody who participates in the chat here today will have an opportunity to win. Um, we're going to give away a kind bar, box of kind bar. Um, the only stipulation for that, it is a nut, it is a nut bar, so the only person who can win is a person with a nut allergy, 
Okay? So if you don't have, if you don't have a nut allergy, please don't even try to play. <laughs> <laughs> and then we'd like you to please record yourself eating the kind bar and send us a video. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, so I'm actually going to give you guys some options. Uh, when I find my phone at some point, but um, here's option number one. You can win uh, some of the beef jerky that I love. Um, if you want beef jerky, let me know. So that's one vote for beef jerky. Uh, for our vegan friends that we constantly make fun of, uh, we have some hip piece straws. We'll give you a case of that. <laughs> Drac has whatever allergy he needs to have. To <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. That's so, a good contestant right there. Hip, hip peas. Hip peas is the other thing that we're going to be giving away. Uh, this is actually becoming slowly one of my most favorite things in the world, the Pure Body Wipes. Uh, I got a box of these for the giveaways. Uh, I didn't get them. Somebody put, put me onto these and got them for me, uh, Leto. Apparently I stink, she's trying to tell me something. And I've been using these religiously after my workouts. These are so good Can to have. Can you demonstrate how you use them? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I'll do it in just a second. But these are great. So it's a nice thing to have just generally in the car, everywhere you are. So when you sweat and you stink, you can totally just, you know, real quick, just, <laughs> just the major spots. <laughs> That's how I use them. Uh, IV baby, this is one of the best things in the world. Some of my uh, friends who drink alcohol live by this. This is a great way to rehydrate uh, after you drink or use it what it's meant for. Uh, rehydrate after your exercise or during your exercise. It's probably a better choice. Uh, my favorite salt sticks, something I use all the time. These are chewable electrolytes. I chew them, I drink the water. Uh, it doesn't keep my stomach heavy. I love the shit. Uh, one of those will be the option. Uh, the infamous Kind Bar. We do have Kind Bars, and I was joking, you definitely shouldn't have a nut allergy, nut allergy to eat these, so. And last but not least, we have some protein shakes and stuff we'll give away to later throughout the week. That'll be cases in the Fitcoin application and uh, AG1. We'll give some AG1 away to somebody. Those will be weekly challenges for a case of protein, both carnivore, and this is not protein, this is energy C. Uh, it says it boosts your immune system, but that is bullshit, right? Right? Exactly. Exactly. So another you another scheme. People say I scam people, right? <laughs> this, <laughs> this is a whole nother scam here. If you like it, it tastes good. So there's that. And It'll could, placebo you into good health. Yeah, but you know what you could do with these? If you mix these up and put those in those little popsicle things, and then you can have like a healthy popsicle. Uh, that won't boost your immunity, but it also won't boost your fat content in your body. So Ooh. there's that. Yo, good morning, Rainbow. So those are kind of the giveaways we've got going on this week. This week, next week, uh, all throughout July. Really excited to do all that stuff. It's 807 Rock, so why don't you start, go ahead and start warming up. Let me go find my phone. <laughs> No, we won't drop rope. We're just, we're doing no, no, we're just going to do our regular warm-up. Let All me right. just start a clock and I'll get some music going. Everybody who's working out with us today, please go ahead. What's up? Rudy's over here paparazzi. Um, everybody who's working out with us today, please go ahead and start tracking your workout. Are you tracking? You can track on your Apple Watch. Totally fine. I'm really slow with my puns this morning. It's very disappointing. Disappointing. I'm very disappointed. This. Starting your temperature workout. I think get I ready. just got a Slack message. Oh, get ready. Are you slacking off? Let's go. Ooh, Tai Chi. You ready? Set, and Exercise. here we go. Leg like rise and weightlifting the first one. Because <laughs> they, know, they know you don't lift weights. You just pretend. Uh, how do you think I got these guns yet? Yeah, guns. Nice. That the, the thumbnail is a gun. Good job, Rox. Thank you. Good job, Rox. <laughs> it's really awkward working out that music, isn't it? Why is it awkward? I don't know. It's just really awkward. Exercise. Because you can hear every sound. Because I can hear my out. thoughts. Mm -hmm. And I have awkward thoughts. Alex has weird thoughts. What else is new? Oh, I like the rock music you were playing. The rock time. music? Okay. Better, this is nice too. 
I'm very sun. slow this morning. Christine, what's up? Thanks for popping in. Just let it run in the background so it seems like a lot of people are watching. <laughs> 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 so do you, do you guys do you guys want to see my paintball gun? <laughs> I don't know how I feel about Rudy getting camera. Yeah, did you just get a camera, Rudy? Like four years ago, I was using it for the first time. Rudy. It's like Rudy's paintball gun. Fifteen years collecting scars. <laughs> Rudy, do you have a paintball gun? Yeah. Can you bring it? Yeah. You know what happens when the paintball gun shows up? It just eats all the CO2. <laughs> <laughs> Exercise. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I come back, it's in the trash. <laughs> you guys remember, if you're here for the first time, welcome. Thanks for being here. Uh, we do our best to give you all the tools you need to be successful on your fitness journey. Um, Along with a lot of fun shit. Roxy's pretty funny. I'm not. <laughs> it didn't work the first time, so you know. They say third time's the charm, Roxy. <laughs> Thank you. Anyway. I just broke everything. Let's get that out of the way. Perfect. Oh, the workout paused in you. And switch. Uh, this music's super low. Soup or low? Yeah! We're just taking photos in the hallway. All right. Okay, now we're back. Now we're serious. Let's talk about something serious that I started reading yesterday. Um, the medical media. <laughs> <laughs> Has anybody heard of the medical medium? Exercise. Has anybody heard of the medical medium? Because if you haven't, you should start reading his book. It is great. It is so good. He talks to the spirit. Hold on, I wrote this down because it was too good and I can't remember. Who does he talk to? Yeti's farming? Where? The medical medium speaks to the spirit of the Most High. Do you guys know who the spirit of the Most High is? Oh, Yeti, you're almost there, bro. You're almost there. He speaks to the spirit of the Most High. Dr. Kaborkin? No. <laughs> no. The spirit of the Most High. I immediately, immediately thought spirit of the Most High was Snoop Dogg. But it's not. <laughs> it is not Willie Nelson, and it is not Cheech and Chong. Woody Harrelson? Not Woody Harrelson. Chimichangas? The chimichangas are good. Um, so, my guy, um, I think his name is Anthony. Uh, I forgot his last name. He's not a medical doctor. He's not trained in any kind of medicine or exercise science or psychiatry or anything, anything to do with wellness at all. He's not, he's not. Uh, he speaks to the spirit of the most high. The spirit of the most high presented himself to him when he was four years old at the dinner table. And it was a gray old man. But that was your uncle. And the gray old ma man kept saying something along, I am the spirit of the most high. I am the spirit of the most high. I am the spirit of the most high. And from that point forward, since he was four, Exercise. the spirit of the Most High has helped him diagnose disease. And, speak, and speak to people like this and go, No, no, not that. No. But it, it tells them what is wrong with you, uh, mentally, physically, that doctors have failed to diagnose or have misdiagnosed and is what's keeping you sick. So. There's an entire book, book, not book, but books, about how the spirit will guide you to become better. Now, there's an entire cult following behind this man. 
and the spirit of the Most High to start DJ. Um, there's an entire cult following of this man uh, and his healing processes. Now, I subscribe to the fact that if you do something consistently and constantly with intention, regardless of what it is, it'll work for you. So there's some definite truth into what this sir does. We're gonna start with goblet squats. All right, so we're gonna start with goblet squats. These are gonna be timed workouts, and I'll jump into my medical medium story in just a second. Um, we're gonna start with 10 pounds. Roxy's gonna do 10 reps, and then we're gonna wait one minute, and then she's gonna do it again. So I'm gonna set a clock for you guys. It's called the EMOM. EMOM. That's every minute on the minute. We're gonna do 10 minutes of this. She's gonna go up by 10 pounds every minute, trying to do. <laughs> 10 pounds every minute on the minute for 10 reps. That means she'll end up at 100 pounds. More than likely, she can't do 100 pounds. So what she will do is when she reaches a weight that she thinks is the limit for her at this workout, she'll stay there, potentially go up five more pounds and drop the reps of 10 down to five, okay? So my estimation is the first five rounds, she'll do reps of 10, which will get her legs nice and warmed up, and then we'll do some progressive overload and five by five training from round number five to round number 10, or actually round number six to round number 10. <clears throat> That's what I would tell my mom when she asked me to do chores around the house. E-mom? E-mom! <laughs> Do you have a joke for us today? I should do. Oh my god. Do you know how many hernia jokes I read through? <laughs> a lot. And just to give you context as to why she wants to tell hernia jokes is because I'm injured and she's making fun of my disability. Fucking bully. <laughs> <laughs> Are you guys Actually <laughs> You told us that you may not have a hernia. I may not, so but I also 50, may have a hernia. I'm 50% bully. <laughs> Are you ready? So she might be a bully. I might be a bully. I might get be a bully. Get ready. Let's go. Exercise. We're going to get to 10 reps. Let's go. I also learned a lot about what you had to go through for your hernia exam. <laughs> Please explain to the audience as to what a hernia exam is like. Alex got violated. <laughs> The medical medium. My point to the medical medium story is I'm, I'm very much so considering denouncing all my education and all my experience just and calling myself the muscular medium. I'm going up by 10 pounds? 10 pounds. You got a 25 second break. I, I, might, just, I might just go muscular medium. And then I, I'm going to find out. But your a, muscular is large. Yeah, muscular medium, right? But your muscular's large. <laughs> My muscular, but... <laughs> or I'll be the muscular large. <laughs> there we go, I'll be the muscular large. <laughs> and I'm gonna write books. I'm gonna write books. And uh, he's the guy, he's the guy I think who started... <laughs> Muscular, yes, that, that could be my alter ego, the muscular medium, and I just need to find a spirit of all, all high that's relatable to the muscular medium, and I just walk up to people and be like, your muscles are frail. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do a quick search and see if there is a muscular medium. If there is not, can someone please make the website for me ASAP? Rainbow, I feel like that's your department. Uh, G can probably... <laughs> oh, oh, the mus muscle surcist. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Muscle sizer. <laughs> like the muscle exorcist? Medium. No, like the exorcist. The muscle cyst? The mu muscle cyst? <laughs> muscle cyst. <laughs> I'm the muscle cyst. <laughs> Sounds and like... You have to talk to them in an Arnold accent. <laughs> well, I found the AI that you can actually, so we could do the whole voice like this and then apply the AI to it and it'll just take my voice and make me sound Domain's like Arnold. Huh? Domain's available. Swoop it. Muscular medium, is it? Please, dot com? Yeah. No way. What is it, $9.99? <laughs> Please get it. Oh my God. How do I transfer it over? Uh, and we'll figure that money. out. <laughs> You guys were here, you guys were here the day the muscular medium was created. 
Now I just need to find a nice little uh, spirit to talk to. This is real, you guys. The spirit came to me while I was reading the book last night and said, you need to be the muscular medium and you need to heal people's <clears throat> frail muscles and body fat, obesity, cardiovascular disease. I'm here for it. I'm here for it. <laughs> Rainbow just checked too. <laughs> Rainbow said it can be a 60 day hassle to transfer domains. That's okay. It'll take us 60 days to set it up. No worry. <clears throat> What we can do is do a full on AI experiment, like a side ex experiment with AI. I saw an AI that completely builds a website for you, landing page, designed based on what you want. Um, we can download the Muscular Medium's books, put them in GPT-4, and have GPT-4 spit out like a full on parody version of this Muscular Medium, and see what happens. This sounds like a fun little project. Okay. Okay. While you're working out. I'm gonna get those those fake little circle glasses. What? I just finished. You must have done something wrong. You're too excited by the muscular medium. The muscular medium got in your head and made you do extra work. <laughs> this is round number five. Give me five reps. Go. Let's Can go. You help me? Yeah. Just give go. me. You got it. Yeah. Five. Give me five. My hands are kind of busy. AI already writes code, Rainbow. <laughs> Look, we play, but we also make sure Rox is okay. We just need to really think it through. Will you help me with the 60s? I will help you with the 60s. I just want you guys to understand. I'm telling her I have a hernia and she's telling me pick up weights. Oh, you don't No, have no, it's one. cool. No, it's fine. Ready? No, no, it's fine. <laughs> Five reps. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, I'll stick with this way. Yeah, who's, who's actually working out? I know we bullshit a lot this morning. But... Now, all jokes aside, uh, the, the easiest way and the best way to target stubborn fat uh, is by lifting weights. You lift weights, it's a lot easier to mobilize your fat and burn those stubborn fat. Fats in all those places. Get ready, we're gonna start in 10 seconds. Do you need help or not? Guess not. In five seconds, three, two, one. Let's go. Five reps, you're on five reps, you guys. This is round number seven of 10. I think uh, all of next week's challenges will be giveaway challenges, no more NFTs. Uh, we should be ready to go swap out from the test environment to the main environment in the next two weeks, fully live. Um, I may ask you guys here, since uh, a lot of you follow here, most of you are using the application. We're considering doing two things. Uh, one, we are gonna do a crowdfund for the project where we let everybody uh, invest into the project for actual shares of the company. I'm just curious who'd be interested in, you know, participating in that. We're gonna do it anyway, uh, and I just want to float that idea out for you guys. Uh, very minimal investment, 50 bucks, and you get a piece of the company. 50 bucks minimum investment, you can invest as much as you want, up to as much as you want. Um, but I, want, I wanted to make it manageable for most of you who are playing so you can have a little stake in what we're building and and make it legitimate, like an actual, actual shares of the company. So if the company ever does go public, 
you'll get something out of it and it won't just be, you know, me scamming people. <laughs> Uh, that's one. Two, uh, we might just do an ICO for the token itself. And the reason I want to do them both ways is, you know, we have our Web3 community that goes after the coin offerings, and then we have our Web2 community and the community that is hopefully going to merge here. So I want to give everybody the options to be able to participate in the way they like. You know, ICOs are random, you don't know what will happen. Uh, but shares in the company, the company's not going anywhere. So, a couple things we've been talking about here at Bitcoin, and we're trying to figure out. The crowdfunding is going to happen within the next few weeks, so curious what you guys think about that. And uh, the ICO we're thinking about might happen also in the next few weeks. But just wanted to float that out here while we're doing our exercises, since Yeti said Fitbit and tracking with y'all. I'm seeing those ICO stars. You see the stars? It's the best. I haven't seen stars in a long time. <laughs> also, I need to know what we're going to give away today. Last one, Lux. Last one. Exercise. You need help? Yes. Hold on. Cool, Rainbow. All right, we got a two minute break, guys. Two minute break. I'll turn this down a little bit. Yeah, the, crowd, the crowdfunding platform we're looking at is specifically designed for our types of project. It is super simplified. The whole process takes about two minutes. I know I have I know I have family and friends who want to participate um, and help get the project up and out. Um, it's just that where we're at with the fundraising is really high price point to get in, so I can understand why people cannot do that at the moment. But I think there's a lot of people who want to help out. They just want to help out, make sure or see the project get off the ground and be successful. So that's that's probably the main reason why I'm doing it. <clears throat> allowing more people to participate and, and personally I think if I was in a project and this is me kind of being a salesperson now but also being honest about it if I was if I was participating in a project and they off and it's something that I liked and they offered me opportunity to participate financially to get later financial award if the, par the, <clears throat> the application does well I'd participate, and I'd par probably participate personally at my level, about five hundred to a thousand dollars. That's kind of where I'd be at, especially if it's something I like. Um, if it's something I don't like, obviously I wouldn't participate. Right? We like. We like. We like. Yeah. It's like uh, when people come in here and they give, you know, ten bucks, twenty bucks, five bucks for the streams. Thank you. Same kind of concept. All right. What do you call a party? <laughs> <laughs> Where you sip and eat. Or yesterday. What? <laughs> what do you call a party when you sit and eat? <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> Stare, pause. <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> what? We don't know. Participate. Party. Sip. <laughs> Eight. Eight. <laughs> Yesterday. <laughs> Where'd you go, Alex? <laughs> That's what we call a stretch. So you got your stretching for today, you guys. <laughs> oh, you know what we'll do, so everybody can play. Let's keep keep on the legs. Let's incorporate some of the back. That was good. That was a good tie-in, also. <clears throat> I think this fit will get up to you guys. If uh, if you don't have a box, if you don't have a box, you're gonna do a dumbbell deadlift. If you don't have a box, you're gonna do a dumbbell. This fit is never okay. <laughs> silly question is that? <laughs> that's that's just silly, man. <laughs> this is not okay. 
So here's what we're doing. If if you have a box. When you say we. <laughs> we, I mean everybody who's actually doing the workout. We're going to do heels up on the box and we're going to sit all the way down and all the way up. Okay? So that will incorporate, you know, this is compound work again. You're going to get some hamstring work. You're going to get some inner thighs. You're going to feel this in your inner thighs. You will too if you did the Wednesday workout with the ladders. You're going to feel this. <coughs> If you don't, if you don't have a box, what I want you to do is just a nice old school dumbbell deadlift. Middle of your shins, nice and balanced. Okay. Use dumbbells that you have. If you only have one dumbbell, the motion will be like this. Okay. Roxy's gonna go 10 pounds. She's gonna go up by five pounds on this. We're gonna do the timing the same, 10 minutes, go up by five pounds. If, if you don't have multiple weights and you can't do an overload or kind of like a ladder, use the heaviest weight that you have that you're capable of doing and stick with it for 10 rounds. Try to get 10 reps. Again, if she can't get 10 reps, we'll drop it down to five. I want it to get pretty, don't sit on the dumbbells. <laughs> <laughs> Is that how your prostate exam happened? I didn't, have a, I didn't have a prostate exam. Go. Go. Nice. Take a break. Let's put those away or else we're gonna have a dumbbell mess over here. A party. We already have two dumbbells in here. We don't need any more. <laughs> Is misfit okay? Question I ask myself daily. I was super lazy this morning. You don't want me to be okay, okay? Yeah, if misfit and I were okay, this would be the most boring stream. Boring. Boring. Did that was not me. <laughs> Did you fart? <laughs> That was the... She, she just farted! I did not fart! On camera! I heard it over here! Maybe, you, maybe you, you got a prostate exam. See? <laughs> Do your <my> exercise. <laughs> go, go, go. Clock's on. Don't worry about the clock. I got the clock. <laughs> Why it's not a good choice on camera. Roxy's wearing great, better choice. But full white. You look like an angel. <laughs> Miss Fart, yes. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm the muscular medium and this is Miss Fart. <laughs> the spirit of on high. That's how I communicate. <laughs> it's fart to fit. It's fart to fit, that's right. Your flatulence will tell me where you are lacking. She didn't like that. She's like, She's thinking of a comeback, you guys. <laughs> We're waiting. Exercise. <laughs> you are, aren't you? I was, yeah. Yeah, I know, I can see it. There was a pun pending. What? <laughs> <laughs> Two. You keep working, I'll be right back. Three. <laughs> Four, five, six, seven. <laughs> Wardrobe shift. <coughs> I didn't like my white shirt. Made me look fat. And then we're talking about losing fat on the stream, and I look fat and I don't <laughs> like it. Alex is on his period today. A little emotional. Menopause. You slow down. Oh. Everybody take a break. Roxy too, take a break. Get, you, get ready for your next exercise, but take a break. Uh, we're gonna drop these sets into five now. Let's drop these sets into five. We're getting heavy. The time's going by too fast. Two, three, we'll just pretend I didn't say take a break, but that's okay. Four. This will be the break. Five, good. Catch up first. 
How's that feel? Can you go up? Um, sure. Let's just move you up to 50, dear. What? Yeah. Gangster shit. Oh, oh that's right. That's a 40 and a 50. No, no, no. <laughs> you don't know nothing. <laughs> Get ready. Fives you count, this is heavy. You got this. Yep. Oh yeah, come on, one. If you can't do five, give me two. And you can stop at two with heavy weights. Three. Four. Five. Dave, please explain your question a little bit better. Clarify your question and I'll help you. Is it better to rack heavier weights on the top or the bottom? Please clarify the question and I will answer it. I think he means like this or like this. Uh, on, if you're doing this exercise, it's better. The reason, the reason I want you to hold the weights to the side and low is because we went from here, first exercise, second exercise, exercise. and I'll explain right now. You need help or are you good? I'm good. <sighs> although, although this is a squat, technically this is a squat, by holding the weights to your side, you're also engaging your upper back. Two is good. Yeah. Two is good, by the way. Heavy weights, two is good. Uh, no, I mean for storage on dumbbell rack. Heavier weights on the bottom. Heavier weights on the bottom. Lighter weights on the top. You're talking about here? Lighter weights on top, heavier weights on the bottom. You know, when you do not want a heavy weight falling from up here onto your foot, bad news. Down there, still don't want it to happen, but at least it's minimal distance. Uh, reduce that risk of injury. I, w I wouldn't store them on top. I know I've seen it, some people do it, but I wouldn't do it. Exercise. But the reason we're actually moving from a goblet squat to a standing squat with the weights on the side is because up here we're engaging kind of chest, core, shoulders, legs, right? When we bring it down, legs are still going, core is still engaged, but now we're engaging our upper back and our traps. And the next exercise we're gonna do from here is our single arm row. So it's a little progression of everything we're doing. There's actually method to my madness. I know I just kind of bumble on a little bit and rant and <clears throat> ramble, but, but there's an actual method to my exercise patterns. It's not just random. It really isn't random. Believe it if you want. And if you don't, that's your choice. Said by the muscle medium. <laughs> Brought to you by the muscular medium. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get those little round glasses when I do the do the roll of the muscular medium. Rudy, did you buy the website? Sick! We we own muscularmedium.com. I would implore everybody to write a Completely. Can you guys write a review for me as the muscular medium? But make it completely fantastical and insane and obnoxious. Like, just the craziest thing you can think of that has to do with fitness. Like how I changed your life. <laughs> Tater tots. You got clients coming? Teddy. And sorry, you? Janice. Ooh. I closed my exercise room. You closed? See? Perfect. We were, we were talking, Andrew and I were talking about this yesterday. I think the, the American Heart Association or one, one, of, these, one of these medical associations recommends uh, 150 zone minutes of exercise. I'll double check my facts. 150 zone minutes of exercise. How often? It's some, some number like that. Do you guys know the answer? Zone exercise means that your heart rate's in a fat burn or a cardiovascular peak zone 
uh, for a minute, for at least a minute. That's one zone. So one, one zone minute is if your heart rate is 120 or above, uh, for some people 112 and above uh, for a minute. Uh, there's a recommendation for this. Do you guys know what the recommendation is? That it's 150, but do you know the time frame that recommendation is? Do you have any guesses? For how many minutes? 12. Hun no, 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 like 150 zone minutes uh -huh. and what period of time is considered active and healthy? Like, meaning like day, two day, three day, days, two day, three day, week. A day. A day. 150 zone minutes a day. Is it a week? What else do we have there? Go ahead, it's exercise time. Two reps. Last round. Chalk it up. Chalk it up. Four days. I'll, I'll relook re the facts because I don't want to misinform people. But it's it's. Let me let me find it while you guys are doing this. So I'm not I'm not spewing bullshit. Every week. Every three days. <sighs> It is the American Heart Association. I was correct. And it is 150 active zone minutes. Take a break. Period of four days. It is not a period of four days. Uh, I'm just gonna. What do you think it is? I know. I mean, I know what it oh, is. Oh, you know what it is. I know what it is. We're really talking about it. <laughs> it is 150 minutes a week. It is 150 minutes a week. That's horrible, you guys. That is. I mean, it's a. I mean, it's a great place to start. Twenty active minutes a day. Twenty active minutes a day to get your heart rate a little bit higher than what it is at resting. I can go on forever, baby. <laughs> That's so bad. That's so bad. I was very disappointed in that fact. I didn't know that fact. Well, it's the American Heart Association. But I mean. How hard? Like 20 minutes a day what to get your NIH heart rate say? up? Uh, NIH, uh, NIH, 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 NIH. What does Andrew Huberman say? You should listen to him. Oh. Andrew Huberman, if you just do his morning routine, you're going to have more than 20 minutes in a day. Go for a hike, find the sun, get outside. That's it. You're already there. We're there. <laughs> already, we're there, man. What is that from? Huh? I don't know. <laughs> what is it? Oh. <laughs> Best We're movie, there. Dumb and Dumber. <laughs> We're gonna go to, where do you say, Aspen? We're going to Aspen, California. Yes. <laughs> you know, you can, that's the point of the, the muscular medium will show you how to all become the muscular medium. The muscular large or the muscular extra large. All I wanna say is a word that. Zoom, 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 and a boom, boom? <laughs> that's all I wanna do. Oh. <laughs> There is pink, pink splatter all over the floor here from the paintball. That's how all right, we're going to go into a single arm row. I'm going to keep Roxy at her 50. She's going to suffer today. Oh, this room is out of the way. Uh, clock is going to be the same. The only difference today or now is going to be that we're going to do it here, suspended in the air. So they say, Dave. We gotta take into account the audience, right? 20 minutes of movement a day for somebody who's already at risk for cardiovascular disease, probably not gonna do much. Sorry, not sorry. Maybe 20 minutes a day for, I would even say most people. I just wanna give a shout out to my sock and shoe combo today. <laughs> We're doing single arm rows. <laughs> I just realized the socks are the same color as these little hooks that the lace loops through. Fashion. Single. <laughs> Not only do we get you fit, we give you fashion advice. This is fit fashion. They can't see that. 
I can see oh, I it. <laughs> I, I thought for she was posing for, for you guys. <laughs> Single arm row, clock's the same. Clock's the same. Right side, left side. Right side, left side. So these are, th again, one minute intervals. We're going to do five on the right, five on the left. This is going to be a true five by five. So I want Roxy to try to hit five reps at a time. If she can't pull the 50 pounds, I'm going to drop her down to 45. And then we're going to drop her down to 40 if she can't do it. But I have faith because <laughs> the spirit of all high told me. Um, and if you guys didn't know, that spirit that he talks to, the only spirit above him is God. Just He says that in his book. God is the spirit of the most high. There is none other. <laughs> no, no. If you're the spirit of the most high and there's somebody higher than you, that makes no sense. Then that's the spirit of the most high. I hate the muscular <laughs> medium, not the medical medium. No, just by default, it makes no sense to well, be the spirit of the most high. Except what about he's the spirit higher. of the most highest? That's, that doesn't make sense. Why? Most highest? <laughs> If you're, if you're the spirit Exercise. of the most high, there's nothing else above you because you're the most high. I think they were just high. <laughs> Roxy, go <don't> man. <laughs> I just like for things to make sense. Like my socks and shoes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah. I just want to point out what she's doing is not easy. She was in a split stance, fully braced, arm back, perfect form. That's even more perfect than my most perfectest. Most perfect high form. <laughs> highest, most highestest. That is a tough exercise. She had no brace. She's bracing with her core and her legs. That's tough. That's tough. Thanks, Alex. Take your break. Wait for it to be. Oh, we're doing breaks yes, and then breaks, switch? Breaks, yeah. Next, How next time. Nice Exercise. Whoa. I'm gonna clip that. We're gonna put that on Insta, because look at that. You guys, if anybody needs their lawnmower started, <laughs> holler. Is that what it sounds like? Or it's more like. <laughs> The best. <laughs> I just I wish I could finish my joke to the end. <laughs> <laughs> and now she's crying. You're just so good at my life. She's so good at my life. <laughs> like I was about to shimmy. <laughs> You're about to shimmy? What is what? I was about to shimmy with the horse. It was funny in my head. <laughs> good morning. Go ahead. Good morning. <laughs> I good love morning. that color. How are you? I'm good. Can I walk through? Yeah, no, why don't you come hang out? That's an awesome color. Thank you. <laughs> it's almost as awesome as my sock and shoe combo. <laughs> Do your exercise. I think I could go higher. All right, we'll go higher next time. Like the most Yeah, like the spirit of the most high. Um, young lady, you're gonna have to elliptical. Oh. Yeah, just cause it gets a little. Don't worry. Wah wah wah, and then oh, Rock's oh, gonna go wah wah, and then start shimmying. It's gonna be weird. <laughs> what do you call it when you're? <laughs> <laughs> I love your. <laughs> <laughs> what you're right here is like tickling. <laughs> <laughs> here for you for the next round. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, you're going to have fun editing this one. <laughs> what do you call it? <laughs> Alex, don't do that. You're going to hurt your hernia. All of a sudden, she cares. 
gas lighter. <laughs> How much tall is you like this? Exercise. What are you guys on today? Well, Roxy was just on a weight. Yes! <laughs> Woo! <-hoo! laughs> that was good! <laughs> I still say we should eat mushrooms on stream and see what happens. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, tough. That's tough. That's tough. I do have to get a CT scan today. You do today? Uh huh. I do have to get a We CT. wish you the best, Alex. I still want to know what you read that the doctor did to me for my hernia exam. I blushed. Why? <laughs> <laughs> it's a medical procedure. <laughs> okay, you don't. Tell me, don't demonstrate, just I tell won't. me. <laughs> <laughs> they had a cup stuff. They what? They did they cup stuff? No, 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 no. I think the. It's, it's, not, it's not very invasive. Maybe you need to go to the right button. Yeah, right, 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 right. Okay. Focus. Oh, she has to focus. See that? Now they're shaking out the funnies. The word inguino itself is funny. It is inguino. So, for the record, the doctor did not think I had a hernia, but we scheduled the CT just to make sure. Uh, what is confirmed is that there is a tear in my meniscus and a partial tear in my PCL on my left knee. So most of that will be like PT or PRP. If I do get a PRP shot, I'll record the whole thing so you guys can see what that's like. That's pretty cool. They draw the blood, spin it, and then they inject it with the ultrasound oh, right into so the cool. knee. It hurts. Does it? Yeah. You did it. Where did you do your PRP shot? Uh, I... No, no, what, what location of the Oh, my, my, my labrum. Oh, in the labrum. In the oh, labrum. Like, tough. the needle was this big. With, uh, left meniscus. Yeah, the CT, the CT scan will either confirm or exclude uh, what it is. And if it is not a hernia, that's great. Uh, or if it's a small hernia, I have to wear, like, a belt. It's like a jock strap belt I have to wear no under, my, way. under my pants, yeah. Under your pants? Yeah. Like a diaper? Kind of. And it like puts pressure, it puts pressure on wherever the hernia is. Uh, it's interesting. They're like little like hernia holding yeah. soldiers. Yeah. So there's Exercise. that. You guys, um, as we say in Armenian, Ashkov Chetam. Uh, how do you translate Ashkov Chetam to English? Not to jinx it. No, no, but like the literal translation. Oh, to not give you an eye. Ashkov Chetam, inner or left, outer left. Uh, oh, meniscus. Wear, wear it over. Yes, only in public though, Canadian. At home I'll wear it properly, but in public I'll just wear it over. Oh. Tall, you gonna do that? Yeah. Okay, I like that, but let me give you a little breakdown of things to do. Okay. Um, I don't want to bug you. <laughs> no, you're fine. You're fine. Dude, you are getting so fit. Me? Yeah. Thank you. I'm trying. She's obviously not talking to me because I'm already fit. Duh. Obviously, Duh. Alex. Duh. <laughs> you no, you do. You look great, tall. You look great, tall. Thank you. But your back muscular is Yeah, go. Come go. On. Nine, so it's right side, this is five and five. That is the, that is the muscular medium costume, I, I love it. Um, okay, Dave, uh, meniscus is a horizontal tear in my medial meniscus, which is inside. That is where the tear is. We're gonna see uh, what we could do about that. Honestly, it's not hurting like it was when the pain started. So, I've been able to do a lot. But as we've been discussing with the recovery team here, uh, I think by hurting this and it was in so much pain, I tried to continue doing my workouts and 
I had to adjust my position to not feel the pain in my knee, compensate is the proper word. Uh, and I more than likely lifted something improperly or lunged the wrong way, which could have caused a hernia or whatever is going on you in my You also could have caused it with a cough. Probably not. Uh, PCL definitely, this was definitely a non-contact injury. Um, there was no, there's no trauma. There's no specific point in time I felt any type of pop, pain, sprain, anything like that. So definitely this was a non-contact injury. Uh, horizontal tear generally means uh, wear and tear over the years, which makes a lot of sense. This is the first time in my athletic career I've had an injury like this or any kind of knee injury or groin injury, uh, which I've been very fortunate, but with any type of activity, continued activity, uh, injury is part of the process uh, and getting hurt is part of the process. But what is also part of the process is not making excuses and figuring out how to work through injury until you're better and can get back to your peak performing self. Take a break. We have about two minutes here for a break. So I'm going to ask you guys a question. This is a quiz. If uh, whoever guessed this right will win your prize. How about that? Whose prize? The ones we had displayed this morning. Okay. Okay. We have done most of the workouts we need to do. What is left? You don't answer. I don't even know. <laughs> we have done a few workouts. Later, Baker Man. Thanks for hanging out, appreciate you. We have done our workouts. We have done two out of our three workouts. One is left. What is the motion? Who can tell me? Who can tell me? If you tell me what it is, you will win. A prize. I will send. No, not Joe. We're not done yet. We gotta do one more set, and I'm gonna kind of work with Tal while Roxy finishes up the set. We have one more set. <laughs> Everyone's like joke time, joke time. Are you guys done? <laughs> what are you doing over there? Just I think the down. joke time will be the so abs portion. Alternate your lap pull downs with some sit-ups. Four. I did that already. Look at you. This is I already know how you're thinking. So... I did. 25, 25, and then I did 25 sit-ups. Okay, 20, 20, 20, hang it out, let's go. Is it core time? It is a push exercise, day for the win. We did a squat exercise, which was our first exercise. A deadlift is technically a pull exercise. We did our pull exercise. All we have left is our push exercise. And I'm gonna give you guys a choice. Do you wanna do push-ups to finish? Push-ups. Or you wanna do squat and press, keep the legs going? Push-ups. Push-ups? Push-ups. Push-ups, all right. We're gonna clock it. We're gonna clock it. This is gonna be a six minute rotation. One minute per exercise. You're gonna go two, four, six. This is going back to our God of War workout. Your timing on your push-up is like so. I want them wide. I want your shoulders forward and I want your clock in your head going one, two, three, one. Two, three, one. One, two, three, one. One, two, three, two. Take a break. That's it. Two, four, six. What's important here is your timing. Got it? I don't know what that little I just did with my mouth was, but great. Well, we didn't see it, but we'll replay that and zoom in. Push ups are the work. Get ready, my friends. Dave, you win. Um, what do you want, buddy? And Dave, where are you at, dude? Got to make sure we can send it. Go ahead. Where are you at? We got, I can give away the electrolytes. We can give you some energy C's. I could give you some pure active, the body wipes. We could do some hippies. The protein shakes, the protein shakes and uh, the carnivore shakes, the Labrata shakes and uh, the AG1, we're gonna do weekly giveaways, so, and the beef jerky. The stuff that's kind of pricey, we're gonna <clears throat> do that for the weekly challenges in the app, but um, you have a choice of your electrolytes, you have a choice of bless some you. milk bars, bless you. That was an aggressive sneeze, wow. <laughs> ruff, ruff. Ruff, ruff. <laughs> Who was that, was that Rudy? Yeah. <laughs> 
like, thank God that wasn't tall. <laughs> <laughs> so rude, Alex. Boxy, you're killing me. Sneeze louder. I, it was I was, it wasn't one. her. It was Rudy. Oh! <laughs> that was me. Who's the mean one now? <laughs> Jerk? I thought it was her. <laughs> Listen, leave the streaming to the professionals, okay? Okay! <laughs> where are you at, buddy? Tell me where you're at. We can give you a similar win, like via PayPal or something. We'll figure it out. Just tell me where you're at. Send me a DM on Instagram. You won the prize. The prize is the prize. The prize is the prize you won. So, sounds good, dude. Appreciate it. Congratulations, and Way to pay attention. Congrats, Dave. Good job. So when we're doing compound exercises and we're doing five by fives, you can do them a few exercise. ways. You can pick a exercise, which you're gonna do like squats, pick three different leg exercises, work through it. I don't recommend that, but you can do it. Uh, you can pick three different pull exercises and work your way through it, or five, this five by five, right? If you wanna do five by five, you can do it by five as well. Dave, I agree. The community we've made along the way is the biggest prize. I agree, 100%. Uh, thank you for the support, you guys, always. <clears throat> What I like to do, and this is because of what I did with the strong first stuff, so when I'm doing compound work, I like to pick a leg exercise, a push exercise, and a pull exercise, and I work that Monday, Wednesday, Friday. That gave me the best results, like, aesthetically and strength-wise. So, things to consider. I'm was that your six? six? Yeah. That was your six? Yes. Nice, you're gonna go back to two. Last three, left. last round. Makes a big difference when you count like that, doesn't yeah. it? Huge difference. All of a sudden, two push-ups are a pain in the ass. Paul, what's your count? 15 and then 10. Love it. Um, I will be out all of next week, guys. Hi, 10. I will be out all of next week, um, so... I'm gonna try to find a way. Monday, Monday we'll be here to stream. Um, Wednesday I'll be in at Palma at Spring, and I will do a phone stream by the pool in my speedos. You don't, you won't want to miss that. I don't think you should stream in the pool. What? It's frowned upon. Do people want to see that pool? Or? Huh? Yeah, they do. Oh. Paul. Okay. People want me to I'm start. Just in, people want me to start in OnlyFans. Don't be a hater. Don't be a hater. Why is it frowned upon to stream in the pool? To pee in the pool? I don't want to pee in the pool. Stream in the pool. That's not funny. Do your exercise. Are there more? Yeah. How many more? <laughs> you should be on four right now. I am. Yeah, go old school with the phone stream, uh, by the pool, in Palm Springs, um, workout, sweat it out, body weight, crusher. I think that'll be fun. And then Friday, if I have service, I will do it Friday and Saturday too, but I'll be up in the mountains in Fresno. Maybe we'll do stream on the boat. Partying it up, drinking AG1. Again, green juice wasted. Uh oh. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Ten, you can come in. No, we won't. Be. We're just gonna leave the stream running the whole time. No, no, you'll just we'll just keep it going. Don't worry, we want you in the stream. No, no, don't worry. Yeah, uh, if you guys want to look it up, uh, it's Shaver Lake. It's up north in California, Shaver Lake Camp Edison. Uh, like the electric company here, Edison Electric. Uh, pretty sick, sick little spot. Yeah. I haven't taken a week off in a very long time, so I think it's I think it's time. I think I'm de-stressed, take a week off, come back and jump into You're gonna come back to a whole new gym. Yeah, Roxy's gonna redecorate. Uh, 
get this uh, Fitcoin up and out right in time for the summer festivities and fun. And we are done. Way to work, you guys. Workout paused. All right. You got a yeah. joke? I sure do. Let's hear it. Hold on. Let's hear it. Okay. Volume's down. It is joke time. We're not done yet, Ten. I know. You want to come hear the joke? I'm listening to it. Okay, what do you... Okay, um... <laughs> She immediately oh gets God. nervous. <laughs> What's the difference between an accountant and a proctologist? What's the difference be between an accountant and a proctologist? Do you know what a proctologist does? Yeah, prostate exams. Via? <laughs> the anus. <laughs> okay, so what's the difference between an accountant and a proctologist? I don't know. One, look, one looks at spreadsheets. <laughs> one looks at spread cheeks. <laughs> I'm going to shake your head for that one. I didn't use this head. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one. That, a good one? that was a good one. I have yeah. another one. <laughs> Go. It's a you're so ugly joke, but you're okay. not ugly, obviously. <laughs> you're so ugly that when you went to, when you went to the proctologist, the doctor stuck his finger in your mouth. That's it. Happy Friday, you guys. What is... Whoa, Alex. <laughs> I just got really excited. <laughs> I'm not editing but, that in. <laughs> I'm Alex Tiva, a.k.a. everyone. Uh, this was Bitcoin Live. <laughs> if you're not here, you don't know what you're missing. <laughs> we are.